atómico ha ido evolucionando desde que en 1800 John Dalton describió el átomo como una partícula indivisible e indestructible. The world seems almost infinitely complicated, made up of thousands, if not millions, of different materials. Throughout history, people have tried to collect, categorise and analyse them, to find some underlying pattern that would help simplify this seemingly incredibly complicated world. Now, at the dawn of the 21st century, we've made some progress to achieving that long, yearned-for simplification. With the use of particle accelerators, we are starting to understand the nature of the world around us. These machines have revealed a whole array of particles which, we believe, may be the fundamental building blocks of matter. But back in the 19th century, scientists thought that everything on Earth was made of just over 80 elements. These elements were famously arranged in a periodic table by Dmitry Mendeleev. At the time, it was thought that elements were made of indivisible spheres called atoms. But each of the elements behaved in a different way. Did that mean that there were 80 different kinds of atom? And if so, what made them different? Were they different shapes or sizes? Or maybe the atoms were divisible. Maybe they were built of even smaller objects. Tchau, pessoal. Até a próxima vez.